Hey everybody, Dr. Eric Herman, Guru Chiropractor. Peace and love to everybody out there. Back again for a yet another video with my new patient, Joyce, right? Can you tell what she is by what she's wearing? She's a nurse. How long did you say? I've um, been 20, 24 years. God bless you. That's about the same time I've been practicing too. Nice. We're, we're, what we call ourselves veterans or what'd you say? Seasoned. Seasoned, we're seasoned healthcare professionals. Um, so Joyce is in. Right, you found me on Instagram. I did. And she's kind of local. A lot of people are traveling, but she you're from like right around the corner. I am. And you work at the hospital that I we've been going. I grew up around here too, been going to for 40 years. Exactly. Um so you got some neck stuff going on. I do. And a little bit in the lower back, but mainly the neck. neck. You want to say a little bit about what, what what's bothering you? Sure. And how you know, details a little bit. Jammed up. I uh, had an auto accident 2015 i have been in pain ever since then double rear ended right double rear end i was yes. sitting at a red light and a lady lost control and hit another car into mine so i got the impact of two cars Ouch. thank you lady um and didn't see it coming i was at a red light and just heard the first bang and i was the second bang yep and yeah and then that's what started it all started it all off and obviously it's not fully resolved because you're here nope yeah nope. okay but, and you do have some herniations confirmed, right? V MRI confirmed in the neck, um, what'd you say? C3 and two, C2 and three, yep. right? Okay, so we're gonna do a good, uh, we already did the exam. Normally I do the exam on camera, but we didn't do it today. We already did the exam. She's 100% qualified for the ring dinger in the full body. So we're gonna roll right into that. And hopefully you'll be doing better on the way out today. I'm not promising perfect. And I really can't promise results, you know that. I know. But I will promise you I'll do my best. I'll work hard and to do my very best to help you today. Appreciate it. Okay? As long as you're nice to me. I am. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just mess around. <laughs> All right. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to stretch you out a little bit, warm you up a little bit first, just to loosen up. Okay. Right? And then we're going to go right back in the, for the ring dinger, and then we'll roll from there. Sounds good. So go ahead and lay back down on your belly. Stay relaxed. If anything I'm doing doesn't feel good to you, let me know, please. Okay? All right, stay relaxed. I'm just stretching you. Good. Just a little warm up. Good. Yep. I like to warm up my patients because I feel like it gives you a better release. So I loosen up the muscles first. Good. Good. Now we're gonna do a little massage with the massager. Call it the thumpa. I've been playing around with wearing scrubs instead of what I'm wearing. Some of the other ring dinger doctors around the country wear, wear scrubs. Yeah, that's what I like about it. I'm not really like a sports chiropractor, but people think I am because of what I wear and because and I'm in shape and stuff. I'm just a chiropractor specializing in spinal decompression, ring dinger. But we'll see. Yeah, I think so. Just stay relaxed. It's. Do 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 do. Good. Like just a little mini little warm up. So when you're ready, come on up. We're getting up and we're going in the back room for the ring dinger. Head here on your back. <clears throat> Good. Scoot down. Yep. Lay down. Hands up top for a second. Yep. I gotta feel your top of your hips because we gotta line you up proper. Okay. So scoot down about three inches towards your feet. Right there, perfect. Now, table's coming up. I'm just telling you what's up. You don't have to do anything. Just stay relaxed. Good. Now, the legs are going to come up like this. Just, again, let the table do the job. Keep it, Let them bend and let them stay relaxed. Good, good. Now, we gotta pin you in above your iliac crest, above your hip bones. It's gonna be pretty tight. Okay. So try to deal with it, because the tight 
like anchoring here is what gets the whole spine released. Okay. Let me get around this side first. Uh, after the holidays, everybody, everybody's holes go out a little yeah, bit further. No further. I'm trying not to. <laughs> you got, yeah, yeah, I'm 24. I've got like another 24 to go. Good for you. Yeah. Got anything big planned for Thanksgiving? House hopping to two houses. Oh, nice. <laughs> you good with this? Yeah, okay. extra food, right? And I don't have to cook and clean up. So Hands back to me. I'm just okay. making sure there's no slack. This is not the treatment. Okay. Good. Now rest them down like on your belly if you're good with that. Okay. okay. Now the towel goes around your neck, but really it grabs the back of your skull and your jaw like this and pulls. Okay. But my hands are too small to get a good grip, so the towel gives me the grip that I need. Okay. I spray with a little water because, so I don't slip, basically. And on Saturdays we use vodka Ooh. for pain relief. <laughs> So, oh, it is Saturday, isn't it? No, no tomorrow's right. Saturday. I don't even know what day it is, man. It's been a weird week. I flew to Houston um, Sunday night, and I trained with Dr. Johnson Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And then I flew home sat a Wednesday on the red eye oh, and, and came back to book solid. And I've been like, it feels like I haven't even stopped. Oh, so. Well, hopefully, you're not working this weekend, right? It's asleep. Tomorrow, I work. Right. Lift up your neck. It's all right. Come on down. Good. Good. So, most important, so listen closely okay. for you, keep your teeth together. Don't bite hard though, but just okay. keep it closed. So when I pull, you don't bang a tooth or God forbid get your tongue in between the teeth. Gotcha. Because I ain't, I ain't sending you to JFK today. <laughs> Please don't. No. Don't have my doctors looking no. at me like, Chris, what you eat? No. <laughs> so, keep the, so keep your mouth closed though, it won't happen. Just breathe through your nose and stay relaxed, okay? Other than that, that's it. You stay relaxed and I'll do the rest. Okay? You ready to go? Yes. All right. Give me a second. Stay loose. Relax your shoulders. Good. Relax. Wiggle your left toe. Oh. 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 I felt. I heard that, too. You heard, right? Definitely here. Woo. Big release. Whoa. I felt it in my back. I felt it everywhere. All the way down, right? Oh. Down. Yeah, oh. that's true spinal oh. decompression right My here. Gosh, that's a legit true decompression. Whoa. The other stuff is just traction. Wow, your spine just got decompressed. <laughs> oh. No pain. Oh God, no pain. Amen. Most yeah. people say no pain. Yeah. Some people it's more intense. Yeah, it's a little because like, yeah. Just like, like and, but some people are more dramatic than others. Yeah, yeah you know yeah. it's subjective. Good for you. The smile says it all. Oh my God, I was in great I felt that all the way up. Yep. Wow. Nothing on the planet does this but this. Wow. That I know of. I'm not, I can't say for sure because yeah. I don't know everything on the planet, yeah. but I've been in the biz for 30 years and I have never come across nothing. So let me no. do a little, no. Okay. What I want to do now is do a little twist release, a little rotational release. Okay. And then we'll go from there. Okay, so we'll do the window. It's okay, okay Zach, keep filming. So stay relaxed, let it go. Good, drop it in my hands. Good, let it go. Oh nice. my God, that was good, nice. oh my gosh. Good, Whoa. okay. Just, when I feel now, much looser. So I think you're gonna feel good when you get up off the table. So I'm done here, so when you're ready, come on up. Okay. If you need help, let me know. Best way to, yep, 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 good. When you stand up, just stop for a second once you're weight bearing. And you know, evaluate okay. and tell the camera how you feel now compared to before, okay. if any different. Usually it is. Okay, much looser up here. Much, Ooh. much, much looser. Yeah. A little, little, little twenty here. You know, yeah, back, back yeah. To We're gonna do a little more, uh, a lot more actually oh, on that table. But the neck feels amazing. I love it, and I'm just looking, just a quick look at your posture. Your head's yeah. way back I feel over. Like I'm like six foot tall. <laughs> yeah, we used to be the same height. What the hell happened here? But. That's a good sign. Yeah. When you feel more oh, like God, released, yeah, yeah, that's from the decompression. Wow. Good job. Yes, yes, I love yes, it. Yes. All right, go back on your belly, okay. nurse Joyce. Okay. Let's do let's do some post checks on on some of those orthopedic tests. See how that's going, and then we're going to do some more adjusting on this table. Posture looks good. Guess what? Remember I told you that little roundedness here yeah. is gone. Wow. Nice. No extra charge. Okay. <laughs> Legs are even. Okay, so remember when I bent it up and you felt some pulling here? Yes. We'll do it again. Tell me if it feels the same or better. Okay. 
hopefully better. Ben, 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 Ben. How's it feel now in the lower back? Uh, actually, a little less straining. Less. Yet. Still some Just pulling? A little bit. Yeah. Reduced? Yes. Amen. That's usually what happens, and that's very good. Most people go from something to reduced, and then when we do here, it gets better, even better. So occasionally, it goes from something to nothing. Okay. Slide down a little bit towards your feet. A little bit more. Right there. All right. So stay relaxed. Um, this pops up, right? Okay. And when I push down on you, it's going to go boom. Okay. So we're going to go boom, 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 boom up the spine. Okay. Just let me know if something that happens that you don't like, but usually nothing does. Good. 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 Feels better already, actually, from the pull. Good. Nice. Nice. Good. Okay. Now I've got to come around on the other side. And we're going to do the lumbar spine. Stay relaxed. Nice. Ouch or no? Uh, no Any painful? <laughs> Good. Good. Stay relaxed. Let it go. Good. All right, take a nice deep breath. Let's bend up again. How's it feel now? Much better. Good. Yes. So the lower back and the pelvis and the hips are doing excellent. Yes. Now we're going to work our way up into thoracics and then we're going to do more work in that neck of yours. Okay. Lifting up the belly part. Good. Now this pops up and we're going to do some push down through here. Stay relaxed. Good. Let it go. Ooh, that was a big release. Take a deep breath in. Blow out slow. Exhale, 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 exhale. Good. Yep, we got it. Good. All right. Okay. Right here. This is going to help with your neck posture. Good. Good. Okay, now we're going to do a little push down in the neck. Okay. Not nearly as strong as here, so don't get worried about that. It's going to be more gentle. Okay. So this is popping up. Stay loose and relax. Chin down a little bit. Good. I want to get right on C23. Right there. Stay relaxed. You okay? Mm -hmm. Good, we'll do a couple more. Good. And one more for good luck. All right, look straight up to the sky. Tilt your right ear down, just plop it down, relax, stretch, stretch. Good, back in the middle. Coming around on the other side. Okay, look up again, straight up. Good, oh, that one was that nice. One. Yes. Nice release here. Which shoulder was a little weak? Um, the left it was the left side, side right? Mm -hmm. And that's where you had the radiculopathy back yes. way back when it first started. You got it. Yeah. We'll check that when you sit up. Okay, roll over on your back, face up for me. <clears throat> now, slide down towards your feet till I say stop. A little more. Stop. Okay. Now we're gonna do front um, clavicle shoulder and breastbone to release from the front perspective. Let me extend here. What I need you to do is arms out like Jesus on the cross. Stay relaxed. Good. Now turn this way. We're going to do where the clavicle attaches to the sternum. Good. Sternoclavicle joint. Stay relaxed. Good. Back in the middle. Slide back up towards your head a little bit. You can bring your arms back up on your body. Now let these come down. Okay. Is this good? You're all right there. Okay. Now I'm going to do a little pull here at the leg at the knee. It should release the knee, maybe even more in the lower back and the hips. Your job, just give it to me. Just floppy, floppy, wow. loose leg. Yep. Relax it. Relax it. There you go. Okay. I felt the knee release. Relax. <laughs> Drop it. <laughs> Boom. Oh, now we do the knee first, and then we'll do the ankle. No toes. Relax, relax, 
Let it go, let it go. There you go, good. Drop it in loose. Yeah. Ooh, Boom! Good one. Big yeah. time. Good Big good. time. You're doing great. Okay, now sit up for me if you need my help. Thank you. Good, swing around, face the dad away. Okay. Let's see. Okay. What do you think? Feels looser to me. Yes, I can tell already. Look at Ooh. that. That's perfect. Be like the exorcist, you know what? <laughs> you got a 360? <laughs> are you gonna do a 180 or what? <laughs> That's hilarious. No, it's okay. We can. Oh, it's still a little tight there, but is it looser than before? Looser than before. Good. It's still a little, you know. Go backwards. Okay. Still got that dizzy, or oh, it's way better, loot flexibility-wise. Yes. Good. All right. Just this one. Bring it up like this. Now push up strong. What do you think? Stronger than before? Stronger than before. Heck yeah. Yes, yeah! Good, relax. So that basically tells me we, we opened up uh, the pressure here, okay. took pressure off the nerve to the deltoid because the deltoid's firing better. Yes. Good. Yes. I'm happy. Yes. Good. All right. Um, we're going to finish off. We're going to adjust the shoulder joint, elbow, wrist, fingers. Unless you don't want me to do the fingers. Yeah. You good with the fingers? I think I'm all right. Fingers better than your Yeah, them nice nails, though. Thank you. On. But how about shoulder and, and yes. elbow? Yes. Okay, so take this arm first, bend in front like so. Right here. I got to give you a hug. Is that okay? Okay. I got to hug around so I get both hands underneath your elbow and pop it up this way. Okay. Okay, stay relaxed. Turn this way. Let it go. This goes out this way. This comes here. Good. Okay. Give me this one, Ben. Elbow down. Relax. Let it go here, drop. Elbow. Good. Ooh, I like that one. Floppy wrist. Good. Nice. Now relax, relax. Pull, pull. Oh, you want me to pull? We have bad oh. timing. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's Sorry, okay. I, was I don't think we could be. I don't think we'd be good dance partners together. We'd be, you'd be, you'd be stepping you on my give me like, toes. I'd be stepping on your toes. Give drop. me like 15 second head notice though. Okay. Relax. relax. Good. Floppy. Good. Nice. Loose. Boom. Good. Why are we doing your fingers if you have the neck problem? Because research shows when you stimulate all the joints, mm -hmm. it sends, it bombards the brain with signals that stimulates it to heal you better. Really? I can feel, yeah. I feel lighter too. Isn't that yeah, good? Yes. All right. We're done for today. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Hold on. Sure. So when you when you first came in, you told me as you were sitting there that your neck was six out of ten pain. Yes. What is it, what would you rate it now? I'm gonna say it's probably about a good three. Good three? three? Good. That's a decent improvement yeah. for one visit. Yep. Good. Post. Um but boo. And you said, well, you you weren't having a headache when you first came no, in, right? No headache, but just tightness up here. Yeah. Yeah. How about the lower back? You told me it was 4 out of 10. Yes, that was probably about oh, like a 2 maybe. Good. Yes. Okay, so we got some decent improvement. Post. Um, so, any questions? No. Okay. <laughs> I got some things. First thing, I'll, I got some homework for you. Okay. If you don't have to rush right out of here after we're done, okay. what I want you to do is go for a 10-minute brisk walk. Okay. While, while you're sh moving your arms like this, keep your head up, don't look down, look forward. 10 minutes as fast as you can walk. Why? Again, research shows when you do that, you're sending messages back up to the brain to pay attention to the new alignment. Okay. And you hold your alignment better and longer. Oh, okay. So it's, it's very important. You'll, you'll just do better if you do this. Okay. Just, to, just now. You don't have to keep doing it every day. Okay. Right now, before you leave in your car, okay. do a little 10-minute brisk walk. Okay. okay. If you have soreness, ice will be your best friend. Okay. Never, never, never heat on okay. a back problem. Um, and the best ice is crushed ice in like a Ziploc as opposed to like a gel pack. Okay. Just not as good gel. Okay. On the skin directly if you can handle it. Okay. Um, if you have any issues like a flare-up or a weird symptom that you're concerned about, Reach out to that guy behind the camera. Let him know. He'll tell me and I'll get on the phone. We'll just do a check and make sure you're okay. okay. It's rare, but occasionally that happens. Occasionally you get a little turbulent after a big release before you start feeling better. But most of the time you just feel better. Okay. Now, regarding follow-ups, 
I would wait a couple days before you make a final assessment on how this did for you. Okay. Because you still got to heal. Today, you don't heal. You get released. Right. You heal after the treatment. Okay. Um, if you feel better and you're happy with what we did, but not all the way better, and you feel like there's more to do and you want to come back to me, mm -hmm. I'd say come back in about a week for a follow-up. Okay. Um, and then we'll do another one and then we'll make a new assessment then. Okay. If you feel good and you're happy, mm -hmm. then come back when you need me. So, but we talked about it in the beginning. Yeah. How do I do that? So here's what I teach my patients for, for you and for everybody out there. These are characteristics of back problems aside from pain. Obviously, back pain is one of them. So if you get pain, mm -hmm. that's one characteristic that you need more of this, like neck pain, back pain, stuff like that. Um, if you feel all jammed up and tight and like nothing you're trying is getting rid of it. Right. Pretty, pretty certain you need some of this, okay. okay? And then I don't know if you've ever experienced this, but when you get jammed up like that, a lot of time the brain wants to stimulate you to try to fix it. So you get that urge that you gotta like, yes. that, you gotta pop yourself. Yes. It's always I nagging. Know, yes. You gotta always try to stretch and pop. Yep. If that, notice, do you have that now? I don't. Right. I don't. I feel like it's a polite and I feel just like, Right, Whoa. because you don't need it. Because And the brain's not going to tell you to do something if you don't need to do it. Right. right? So if it's getting, if you're getting that urge, again, oh, yeah, that means something's brewing. Gotcha. Okay. So any of those characteristics means you need a tune up, right? Maintenance adjustments is coming before the big pain to try to stay in front of it, right. to try to keep your body maintained. Like same thing with a car. When should you tune up your car? When the lights go on nope. or before the lights go on to keep that from happening? Right. Right. So that's kind of how I do it with my patients. Yeah. Maintenance is the best way to go as opposed to wait until there's bad pain and then coming. Right. But listen, it's your life. It's your health. It's your body. So you do what you need to do. But I'm just giving you as, you know, the doctor and my professional responsibility, I'm giving you the best guidelines to how to take care of yourself. Okay. Any questions? You did good. Thank you. I appreciate you coming and tr trusting me. Yes. And I think you're on the definitely on the mend. Yes. Thank you. All right. I needed cool. that. My body, my body thanks you. So appreciate that. I'm happy. My heart is happy. This is my life. This, you know, obviously it's a job and I'm, I'm making money and I'm making a living, but I'm, it's more than that for me. Right. You know, it's kind of like a calling for me without sounding weird and flaky. Right. So I'm happy. That makes me happy. Yes. All right. Cool. Good job. Let's say goodbye to the audience and then we can go home. So, Gurk. Oh, yeah. Like and follow my videos because that gives me better views or something like that. I don't know. And subscribe to my YouTube channel, Guru Chiropractor. All right. So this is the Guru Chiropractor and Nurse Joyce doing a lot better. Yes. Peace and love to everybody out there. God bless. Happy holidays. Happy Thanksgiving. If you need some of this, so you're watching and you're like, I think I need that. I think I need help like she just got. Reach out to my website. It's the best way to get in touch with me. Retrochiropractic.com. All my info's there. I got fees up front. You know, a bunch of information about me and how I do things. And there's a book now link there. Put your info in the book now link. Hit send. Goes to my assistant. He grabs it. He'll contact you. And you guys, you know, work it out. And then you come through. I'll do my very best to help you too. Love and appreciate you. Peace and love. Out.